In your teams, you'll read out two facts, but only one of them will be undeniably true. The other team must figure out whose is a fact and whose is a fib. OK, Josh and Harriet, you're going first. Um, Harriet, please give us your fact or fib. Albert Einstein once worked at Oktoberfest. Oh. Fact. Fact. <laughs> that, doesn't, that doesn't sound... Doesn't sound weird. Yeah. I know it's a, it's a real festival that does happen. Yes. Mm. Yeah. It's definitely German, isn't it? Yeah. Um, um, but like how long maybe has Maybe when he was young, like, did bar work. But how long has it existed for? That's the question. Have you got I, backup? I, I think oh, Oktoberfest I, must have been around for ages, surely. Let's find out. Yeah. Uh, have you got some more backup uh, facts there? We all know Einstein liked a good time. Yeah. Here he is off his head on Jaeger bombs. <laughs> 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 he does look banter, to be fair. You yeah. wouldn't expect... No, he's trying feels. to I warn you that there's a landmine about. Like, yeah. That's <laughs> a little <beta. laughs> yeah. yeah, and just cos he's a scientist doesn't mean he doesn't like tits. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is a little bit booby, isn't it, Oktoberfest? Quite booby at yeah. Oktoberfest, yeah. You know what? I love this as a fact, but I feel like if it was true, the, the organisers would have used him as, like, uh, like right. a logo or, like, a... People would be like, yeah, Einstein loves it here. He's always drinking the pints down back. <laughs> <laughs> people dress up as Einstein. Like, this, he's such a big figure. Yeah. And I've never heard that in my life. And I've been to Oktoberfest before. Uh. What, what was it like? Well, I, I went to the, the one in the UK. So, like, basically, you just went for a pint in October? Yeah. <laughs> 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 there was a bench and a marquee. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, I dressed up as well. Like everyone dresses up, right? And because I don't really drink beer, mm. and you get you have flavoured. Ah, beers well, also this is another way because you dressed up. You always wear a wig when you dress up. Einstein had famous hair. If Einstein had been involved, you would have found that out, and you would have gone as Einstein. Exactly. <laughs> Josh, now what's your? Facts okay. Or fib. Um, so prior to 1936, elevators only went up, not down. <laughs> Come at me, boy. <laughs> <laughs> but no. But, but they it... did go down. How do you Because know? otherwise it would just happen once. No, but I mean, with, with, yeah, but then there's with stairs to go down. In it, with people, so with people, people in it, it could only go up, right? Not okay. Down. So then, you, how do you go down with the steps? Yeah. So you'd have to go and then walk down. Or parachute. Yeah, cos it was too dangerous. There was no counterweight no, uh, system. Think about... So it was too dangerous to go no. down with people in it. Josh is so nice, I believe everything he says. Thank you. <laughs> I'm the opposite. I don't believe anything. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have any, Do you have any uh, other supplementary facts? information yeah. on this? Um, before elevator music, there would be a musician who would play live music. No. Yes, no. he was. <laughs> yes, he was. Have you no. never seen Titanic? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. I think I that might be true. Yeah, when the boat think... was going down. Yeah, when it was going down, they were there. Because you know what? It when you go that... to, like, posh hotels, they got that little seat in the corner yeah. so you could relax. So I do think there was probably someone... Yeah, that was where the guy would sit and there'd be a big grand piano in front of him. <laughs> No, they'd be like a violin. Um, have you got any other questions for Josh and Harriet before we make a decision on who's well, telling the truth? I think because in the early days of elevators, like people were super spooked by them. Right. And so it wasn't until pretty late that they stopped always having attendance in them. Right. Uh, to, so it, it could be like if it's a new technology and people are uncomfortable with it, then. Like broadband? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's elements of it that I do believe, to be honest with you. Right. But... The only thing is, like you said, if there is an attendant and someone playing music, they would have to get off every single time, then take the steps. Yeah, but if you look at old photos of people, they'd be dead skinny, and I think it was cos it was... <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? Because Harriet's one also is very plausible yeah. that... I feel like it's the, the elevator, just because... We would have heard about Einstein at Oktoberfest some yeah. somewhere down. Particularly there. if you've been, someone yeah, would have I've mentioned. Yeah, I've been. It. No one said anything to me there, okay. so I'm going for the lift. Okay, okay. should we go with lift? I, yeah, the let's lift go with lift, true. please. That's so awesome. you think that Josh is telling the truth about lifts only being able to take passengers up, and Harriet was telling a fib. Okay, let's find out who was telling the truth. Oh. God, it's exciting. <laughs> Harry was telling the truth! Oh. You were wrong! No way! Well done. Yes, good work. Well done. They did well there, didn't yeah. they? Yeah. Albert Einstein did once work at Oktoberfest. He installed light bulbs in a beer tent. No way. Big time, yeah. That's a great fact. That's a great fact, I isn't it? I love that. Yeah. yeah.